face-off between the Joint Admission and Matriculation Board, JAMB, and candidates over withheld and cancelled results is still brewing with both parties playing the blame game. The JAMB Registrar, Professor Dibu Ojerinde, who was a guest on our breakfast show, Sunrise Delhi, absolved the examination body of any wrongdoing, stressing that the affected candidates did not meet the adequate requirements as stipulated by JAMB. We told the public that there were outstanding results which were investigating. Some people did not print in the examination center. Some of them did not even um, do the normal thing. They were suspected to be um, malpractice cases. And we said, okay, before we release this result, normally there's a committee that will go over them and decide whether they truly did the right thing or not. In fact, we asked them to come. They wrote us. If you are sure of yourself, come along. Well, they already wrote. They wrote. They wrote letters. Okay. And we responded to the letters. Well, responded we told them, I... please come to on Abuja. this fateful day to Abuja. We will show you, show you your papers. If we are wrong, we will give you 100,000 Naira. And you will 200,000 Naira when you are leaving. They came. None of them won. If government gave me a directive, and I'm following it, see how you can introduce computer-based tests. In the examination, this has been in the, in, the, in, the, in the office for almost three years until we came out with it this year. And we have been saying it. We will do computer-based tests. We will do computer-based tests. That this year, I now have to train my people from last two years on how to, con how to, do, how to conduct computer-based tests. On item response theory, I send them abroad. I send myself, all of us, we gather together. We train them on how to con con uh, um, conduct computer-based tests. Now we know what to do, and we went ahead, following government directive.